guys, what's up? Welcome to my channel. Today's video is going to be a mystery unboxing of beauty products. So I ordered two of them off, that's four, not two. Ordered two of them off of Amazon. My last one I did was off of eBay and I literally spent so much money buying someone's yard sale. That's what we all determined in the video. So if you didn't see my last one, I'll link it down below. It was hilarious. Hilarious! But this one, I spent about a hundred bucks on each box by the time shipping and all that jazz. I ordered them off Amazon instead of eBay. I figured we'd give another go at this and see what we get. Mystery unboxings are always really fun, so we'll just see what happens. But first, we're gonna sing the subscribe song and then we're gonna jump right into the video. Subscribe to my channel before you leave. Be sure and subscribe to my channel before you leave. Subscribe! All right, let's jump right into the video. February is always such an amazing month and I also feel like Valentine's in this month is always fun because I love the aesthetic of like pink and hearts and happiness and love and joy. I love it. So I'm excited February's here. That's a random side note. Let's jump into the first box. I think this one costs a little bit less than a hundred, but let's see what's in it. So I open it up and it's like stacked with makeup. This is all that I've seen. I haven't pulled anything out of the box. Oh my gosh, this is big. I thought this was a little box on top. I am for sure they sell this at the 99 cent store. Guys, maybe I should have stopped hoping with the mystery boxes because they kind of seem like the larky. And by the way, it's really hard on Amazon to find the expensive mystery boxes because they're all like around 50 bucks on there or less. It's hard to find them on there for over that cost. Girl, I'm dead. Okay, maybe they don't have this one at the 99 cent store because I feel like the ones at the 99 cent store are smaller than this, but I don't know. Okay, we got some pigment though. I have black all over my hands because this is Milk Makeup Stamp on me and it kind of exploded. Okay, yeah, this is just kind of like really powdery and chalky feeling just like right off the bat. I'm gonna swatch the red shade. Just like super chunky. Ugh. Okay. So first things first, we got a BR. It's a big kit, but it's just poo poo for makeup. Okay, but that's just me judging it off of two swatches. Oh my gosh, it's another like Dollar Tree kit thing, or I've seen these at Burlington for like two, three dollars. Cause y'all know I do all my Dollar General, Burlington Co Factory, all these different videos like that. So you can't fool me with this stuff. Hi, yeah, yeah. This is like a super cheap kit. Oh my gosh. Hmm. I mean, maybe it'll be pretty. I don't mean to be negative, but kind of thought there would be some name brand makeup in these. I guess not. This is definitely not worth the price I paid for though. So far, could we get luckier? Absolutely. But this is called the Essential Contour Malibu Glitz. Okay. Oh my God, it's another one from the same company, the BR company. It's just another one of those mini palettes and I'm not gonna lie, this packaging, like the white on it is kind of faded, which makes me think it's been setting in a warehouse for too long, which things do have a shelf life. So here it is. You slide it open. I'm just not into it, guys, because I pick up things like this all the time for challenge videos, like on Wish. Yeah, you can get these like little kits like downtown LA for like a couple bucks. Okay, next we have a jewel. <laughs> what is this? Um, oh, it's a lip balm. Okay, strawberry. Oh, 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 I'm so stupid. It clicks open. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, it's like a jelly in there. Oh, it smells good. It's like a clear, a clear jelly. Okay. Can you guys see that little jelly in there? This is actually pretty cool. I don't know that this is worth the cost, but it's actually pretty cool. So I'm not mad about this. Really cute. Boom shakalaka. I got a second fruity lip balm in peach. This one doesn't smell like anything, but there's just like a little peach lip balm in there. Let's move on next. I think this might be some brushes. Hi ho, it is a brush kit. Oh, the brushes seem nice. So I don't know if you can tell, but the brushes seem like a brush that I would actually use. 
Hmm. Okay, so I like the brushes a lot. So that little flat synthetic brush would be really good. I think this is a natural haired uh, blush brush and it feels really nice. So I would actually use all of these brushes. So, I mean, the bag on the brush kit definitely feels really cheap, but the actual brushes, even if they are, it's by ETA Cosmetics, even if they are cheap, like these are brushes that I would use. So I guess I'm excited that these are in there. Oh, sweet mother of God. We got another one. A shell makeup kit. It's like another one of those really cheap makeup kits. I have nothing against, like, if you use these. I'm not saying, like, you're bad at makeup or you don't have good makeup. I'm not saying that. I'm just saying that these are not expensive, so I overpaid for the box. <laughs> As of right now, I'm going to tell you guys maybe don't order the mystery boxes off Amazon or really eBay. But I have to admit... Oopsies, we dropped some pencils. That's kind of cool. Okay. That's kind of cool though. Like, I mean, it's a seashell, like. <sighs> oh my God. God, the whole thing just fell out. Oh my Lord. Okay, I'm gonna stop playing around with this. Of course, the lip glosses hit the floor. Okay. All right, what else is in this box? It looks like we got a Malibu, Malibu, Malibu Glitz. Whoo, she can't talk today. This just seems like a really cheap lipstick. It's a lipstick, by the way, that came in here. Oh my God, one side of it is tan, one side of it is brown. I don't know if this is meant to be like a lip contour, but it's not something I would use. Uh, let's see. Light up lipstick. Yes, it is a lipstick. Okay, so not for me. That's okay. Next up, we have an, oh, we have another light up lipstick. Let's see what shade it is, shall we? Oh my gosh, the exact same shade. They gave me two of the same thing. See, that's just like, what? Why? Yeah, it's the exact same thing. This is such a flop. Like, I'm just gonna call it. It's a flop. And then lastly, I got a little tiny BB cream. We're gonna pump some out and see if it's my shade. This is why I buy two boxes so we can uh, have more fun because if this was the video, right? It's like, girl, what? Okay, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh my gosh, nothing's coming out and I've been pumping for 25 years. It's okay, we're gonna get it. Oh my gosh, it really isn't working. Okay, that's all that came in the box, by the way. That was, I'm not gonna lie, like not worth it at all. Like at all, like a waste of money. Okay, this, literally my hand's cramping. I probably have pumped it over a hundred times. It won't work. So the only thing I probably will use out of the box is the glosses. <laughs> well, I'm five years old. And the brushes, I think, are pretty nice. Definitely could have just bought them separately for way less of the cost. And I probably won't be using these little kits because most of the time they're just really dusty and crusty. I mean, the blush shades might be pretty in them, but not worth the cost. So I give this, like if I had to rate this one through five stars, I give this like a two star, maybe one and a half star. But don't worry, we have one more box we get to go through and it's gonna be great. Okay, I like on the box it says always against animal cruelty. I also like on the box that I opened it upside down. Let's see, this one seems heavier, I will say. I'm really hoping that it's not the same. It wasn't the same buyer that I bought these from. And this has, says S-H-A-N-Y, I don't know how to pronounce that. Shani, 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 right? So I don't know if that's like the company I bought it from, but let's see what's inside. This one was a little more pricey than the other one. Let's dive in. First, I see this thing, which isn't expensive. I could buy this at Sally's for a couple of bucks, but I will use this. So, I mean, I'm not gonna be mad about it. So this is the push-up liquid dispenser. So basically whenever you're in Sephora and you're like trying to wipe your hand off, tap in some makeup remover in one of these, or a lot of times in nail salons, they'll put their acetone in these, which is what I'm gonna do with it. And you just pump it out. So I actually like this a lot. Um, I'll use this, although this is like 99 cent. That's okay. Next, oh yeah, so the brand is Shani. Okay, <laughs> what ifs? So then next I got 12 piece lip gloss set, but they're tiny, tiny, tiny lip glosses. So now I think I'm preparing myself to do a full face of minis. I'm kidding, should I do that video? I don't know. Hmm. Okay, but anyways, I got, I got all these little babies. Should we open it up? Let's open it up and see what's inside. When I tell you that this is sil silent, why did I say silent? <laughs> when I tell you this is tiny, I mean, it's just so tiny. 
It is so tiny. Okay, let's look at the little doe foot. Oh my God, why is it so cute? Oh my God, these are really pigmented. Right there is the shade. Can you guys see? It's like a little pigmented gloss. My hand's a mess because I don't have a makeup wipe on deck. Who sits down to film a video without a makeup wipe? This girl. Let's move on. Next, right on top, I didn't realize everything that comes out of this box is by Shani, this brand. So that's interesting, never heard of it. But I will say this, this is for fingernails. This is kind of cute. Let me take the plastic off so it's not reflective. So it's a fingernail kit and it comes with like all kinds of little jewels and they're so tiny, little stars and beads and different little hearts and things that you can add to your fingernails, which I actually think is kind of cute. I don't know how much this would retail for. You guys comment down below, what do you think? Is this something that's really cheap or not? I don't know, but you do get a lot of different little things in here. Oh, and it even has little glitters up here so you could add to your nails. So this is kind of cute. I could even add them on top of my acrylics if I wanted to like glue some down so I will say so far I am liking this box better if I knew it was all from this brand Shani though I probably wouldn't have ordered this one because I like to get like random stuff out of the boxes yeah it's all one brand I didn't know <laughs> so this is the 12 piece matte lip liner set oh so they are full-size lip liners not minis I was curious and they're pencil liners oh and they're really pigmented Okay, so let's swatch one more of them just to give it a go. Okay, I do like this. I mean, it's pretty cool. Oh my gosh, look how pigmented that is. It's just like colors right off, no problem. I do like the lip liner, so I'll use those. Next, we have something in all this bubble wrap. Beauty book by Shani. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Let's cut her open. Ha <laughs> ha, boom. Okay, I'm not gonna lie, just looking at these eyeshadows, they look really pigmented. I don't know if you can tell. I don't really care for the glosses. Like, I don't use stuff like this, but the blushes look pretty nice, so I would use these. And then it just comes with more glosses and like these things that I despise, like the devil. But the eyeshadow we're about to swatch because it does look kind of pretty. Oh wow. Oh wow. <laughs> the eyeshadow is like, I'm out of hand space. So I'm just gonna go this route. Can you guys see that? Like, oh, that's like pretty shiny. I swatched two more of the shadows right here and they are pretty pigmented. So I would probably use this into the palette and the blushes. The little beauty book is kind of cute. I like it. Okay, next. Oh my God, these are for fingernails. That's why I didn't know what it was off the bat. I don't do nails. I haven't gone to school for doing nails, so I like don't know. But I like that they put this in here. It's all the different little nail tools and you can use these to pick up and apply the little gems to your nails. So that's pretty cool they put that in there as well. Next, I got this little packet and it says blotting paper. So I got a kit of the little blotting paper, shall we? I actually just did my makeup, but oh lord, she's already crazy. Let's see. Mm. Everybody clap your hands. Oh. Oh! You can kind of see, no. Oh, you see a little O? Y'all see a little bit O on there? Yeah, me either. I mean, I think there is a little, but we'll pretend that there's not. <laughs> All right, next I got a Shani liner. I think this is a lip liner, yeah. Their liner seemed to be really a hot item. Oh, we got more blotting papers, okay. And then we got another, I think this is an eyeliner, slim liner. So this is blue. They do a good job with their liner formula, I'll give you that. Let's try out these. Oh, for face, eyes, and lips, okay. So these are pink, let's get that chin. Oops, took a little of my lip. I think it's mostly just taking off makeup because I have so much makeup on that, but I think it is pulling off some old. So blotting sheets you can always use, throw them in your purse, touch up throughout the day. Oh my Lord, there's another thing of blotting sheets. We have three blotting sheets. Next, oh my gosh, we have a professional brush set. So this box has like a lot in it. I will definitely go ahead and tell you that this is worth way more than the other one. God, I got two brush sets. Comes with this little makeup bag. 
Okie dokie, just taking a look at the brushes. I mean, they're all wrapped in plastic. Let's see, four, eight, 12 brushes. So they feel really nice, okay. Yeah, I would definitely use this brush. It feels nice, I'm about to use it right now. I probably should wash it first, but for the video's sake, this is the Tantastic Bronzer. Oh yeah, this brush is nice. Okay, I really like this brush kit too. We are two for two on brush kits, mama. Let me just, close my hand up in there. <laughs> that really hurt. Yeah, I like the brushes in this kit. The bag is a little cheap, but I mean, it's definitely doable. I'm not gonna complain about it that much. The bag I think feels better than the other bag, but it is a bigger kit, so brush kit's nice. And we're not done yet. Oh my God, there's more blotting papers. How oldy am I, honey? Okay, and then it just had tissue paper in the bottom of the box. But this is the last piece and it's another daggum little makeup kit. Comment down below, let me know if you like these, if you're just like, mm, not really my thing. I'm just curious. Because they're sold literally all over eBay, all over Amazon. Dollar Trees always have them. Dollar Generals, 99 cent stores. So I'm curious, you know, cause they're everywhere. Okay, this was like nicely bubble wrapped in there. So this is called Woke, Woke Up Like This Beauty Kit. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Okay, so we got some eyeshadows. Again, the eyeshadows look like they're the same quality as the other beauty book. Oh, how do we open you? It just is a little surprise. So here it is, this is what it looks like. This side is matte and the other side shimmer and then you get some blushes right here. I don't know what these colors are exactly about right here. And yeah, what fell out was these little spoolies, which I'm not a big fan of, but I'm going to swatch this color with it. Why is everything falling today? I'm so annoyed. Yeah, that little eyeshadow had a lot of pigment in it. So I swatched a few more and they all pretty much come across as like a white shimmery with a hint of color in them. So this kit is all right. Will I be using it? I'm gonna be honest, probably not. I would more so use little beauty book, but this little kit's interesting. So I think that box was definitely worth more so the price than the other box. Now I have never bought Shani Cosmetics on my own. Let me look and see just like a gist of how much they cost. Cosmetics, it pulls up instantly, which is good. So they have their own website aside from Amazon. Okay, and it's like a single shadow, seven bucks. A lipstick is seven. The eye kit is 39. The bigger like makeup kit is 17 bucks. And yeah, so it's pretty affordable makeup. Like it's not too expensive makeup, but I did get a lot of it. I don't know, my grand total might go up to about a hundred. Yeah, I probably would, because this was a lot of stuff. So I would say this is better for the price. The other one was a complete. <sighs> Life is like a box of chocolates. You never know what you're gonna get. Okay, that's it for this video. Also, really quickly in this video, I have gotten so many questions because not everybody has seen every video and people are like, what, 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 whenever I did my drugstore transformation. So I'm gonna answer three questions that I got asked a million times in that video really quick. If you don't wanna hear that, you can click out. But people have been asking me, why do you use the M6 brush instead of the Y6? That's because they discontinued the Gilded Collection at Morphe. So they don't have the Y6 anymore. If you still see them on the site or in stores, they're selling the last of it and they won't have them back. So the M6 is the new Y6. Also, who is Erin? Erin is my niece. I have full custody of her and she lives with me now. And the last question was, did I get a new kitten? What's the tea on that? Yes, I got a new kitten. Jerry Graceffa and Daniel found the kitten. They have three Huskies, so it's not the ideal home for a little baby, so I took them in. The cat sanctuary is here, honey. <laughs> Those were the questions. Everybody was like, who is Erin? What brush is this? Is that a new cat? I was like, oh my gosh, there's so much people don't know. A lot's happening right now. And I just wanted to quickly update you guys. But that's it for this video. Thank you all so much for watching. Be sure and subscribe before you leave and turn your notifications on so you can be the first to check out my new videos. I love you guys. Thank you so much for being here and I hope you have a fabulous day.